No, I haven't been to Philly before the draft process. The first time was about a week ago when I was here for my uh, top 30 visit. What, what's your impression? I mean, it's only early, but what, are you excited to, to live here and move back east? And yeah, I'm, ex I'm excited to live here. Um, obviously, the fans here are amazing. Uh, the town atmosphere, the sports atmosphere, atmosphere is so cool uh, looking at this all the stadiums just across the street in that block area it's, it's gonna be a really cool place to live and um, I'm excited what is Carson Wentz said to you uh, you know I talked a little bit to him before we had the same agent um, you know as soon as I got drafted he said let's go homie and then uh, we kind of talked about a few expectations so I'm um, really excited to be here with him uh, kind of a local guy uh, for me so it'll be really cool having him here did he have to do with you picking your agent was he involved in that yeah um, so I was kind of picking between a few different people and uh, you know he sent me a text message and kind of uh, sold them to me uh, for the agency and you know uh, I feel like he's a great guy, a great football player as well and I figured if he liked him uh, I think I'd do good with him as well. When you took your uh, top 30 visit here, what was that like? What do you think they wanted to learn from you during that process? You know, I think uh, they knew quite a bit. I met with them at the Combine as well. I think it was just a little bit more of a feel thing, a little bit more personal. Got to spend a little bit more time with the coaches. And, you know, I just think they wanted to get to know me as a person a little bit better because, obviously, um, I think my tape kind of speaks for myself. I think uh, the meetings at the Combine went really well, so I think it's just more of a kind of a feel thing. Dallas, we've seen a bunch of uh, highlight reel-type catches from you in college. How did you become that guy? Is that something you have to work on? Yeah, I mean, um, I was lucky enough to play at South Dakota State where they uh, used me in the offense a lot, put me in different positions, um, and I was kind of the go-to guy. So um, sometimes a quarterback would be in trouble and uh, throw a ball that was a little bit too high or a little bit too far in front. And I think I have really good ball skills. My athletic ability helped, and I was just able to make some plays. With the way they 